hello friends welcome back to code tonight in today's video we will see uh, an error paypal identity exception the remote server returned an error 401 unauthorized so this is the error that you get uh, while using the paypal payment gateway in sp.net so what happens is uh, when you try to make payments you often receive the error saying this uh, paypal identity exception and if you go to details it will show you and that uh, that the error is invalid client so client authentication failed this is the error that you get so talking about this error is this error basically occurs because uh, you are trying to use uh, live credentials on sandbox or vice versa if you are using sandbox credential on um, live uh, mode then it will also give error and if you are using live credentials on sandbox mode then it will also give error so basically what you can do is uh, you can check the mode passed here to the paypal token uh, paypal token here you will see that the mode is uh, passed to sandbox uh, if you don't know about this code then you can have a look at paypal integration video which we have uploaded earlier so you can get the code from there and then use that so here you can see the mode is passed sandbox which is giving error so we have to change it to live for using the live credentials so in case uh, there is a no mode passed then it will pick by default sandbox and then it also give error so you have to make sure that mode is passed there and it is according to the credentials so now if we try to run the application then we will again try to make a payment from paypal and we will see if that works this time so we will add a breakpoint here and this is the application that is running so we have paypal pay now button here and if you click on that button uh, now we will check the api contact so here in the api contact you will see that uh, uh, we have config mode live here so that means that uh, the mode is set correctly and now if you press f10 then it will uh, initialize the payment procedure and it will retract on the paypal payment screen so here you can see that it will ask for pay with credit or debit card and again this time it is the um, live version how you will know that it is a live version is you can check the url uh, if you are redacted on www.paypal.com then it is a live version if you are redacted on sandbox url then it is a sandbox uh, credential that is working okay so this is how you will know if it is live or and it is sandbox so this time you will see it is working so now um, you can see that it is working this time but uh, if you just uh, um, do it back and now again we will try to make it work then again you will receive the error uh, uh, identity exception so uh, this is just to show you that uh, this is the thing that is causing error So again we will click on pay now button and it will get to the api context and it will throw error here so basically it is a get entity exception so this is how you can fix the issue you can change the mode to sandbox or live according to the credential so thanks for watching guys and if you face any issue then you can comment on the video and we will help you out so thanks for watching